Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cynthia, back again with another video with Baby Yoda here. And we have a mini haul. That's what I've called it, but it's more of an exchange. So I was able to go to the store and it was a successful day. So yeah, let's get right into it. And let me tell you about my experience first. So you guys, if you guys seen my rants video at about Bath and Body Works at the Art and Fair Mall, where I had like the worst experience on trying to exchange some of my candles that I that were brand new, never burnt. I got them online, but whatever. The story is long. Go to that video, and I'll link it down below if you if you want to see that. So I was like a little nervous to go exchange these candles. I had my sister go with me, but I I definitely went to the the another one I, I wasn't gonna go back to the same place and i went to the one by my sister's house which if you live in northern california or sacramento area it is in sacramento sacramento but the town is natomas area i believe natomas is not a city right guys anyways it's over there by where they have a walmart and the the movie theater used to be there and obviously they're all closed now but yeah, and then they have the in and out So it's in that shopping center. And I had the most wonderful experience. Everyone there, as soon as I got in, you know, they ask you why you're there and whatever. They're telling you to sanitize your hands. And the girl there was so nice. And she was like, just, you know, telling me about what kind of can what candles that I have in there that I didn't like. I told her and she's like, oh yeah, the Twisted Peppermint. I don't like that one either. She thought it... Um, it smells like toothpaste. Sorry to all of you guys that love it. That's why I wanted to try it because so many of you guys love it. And I was just like, you know what? I might love it too. But it didn't work out for us. We didn't like it. So we went and returned. I had two of those still. And then I had a small one called Vanilla, the one wick. Vanilla pumpkin marshmallow, I think. I didn't get a throw from that one at all. When you when I do the cold sniff, it was good. But when I um turned it on at home, I didn't get a throw at all, even in one of the, our, our small rooms, um, our kids' room. And so I just decided to exchange that one too. No problems. These people in the Tomas were some of the nicest people I've seen. Like we had four girls, me and my sister were in there together, come up to us and like show us different candles and they were just so lovely. And I just recommend that store, not just for exchanges, please people like to purchase, to go there and give them business because they are running business very well there. Um, that's what I told my sister. I said, right now I don't want to buy anymore because I'm obviously waiting on a sale. I do want more candles. So if they bring that $10 off, I'm going to go there and purchase some candles. And my sister, she said she's going to get some candles too. She wants to get the, because what I talked about in my last one with my top five, uh, she wants to get definitely, she said, the um, you're the one. So yeah. Anyways, let's get into it. It's small. So that intro was long, but let me show you what I got. And this first one I got because, well, my son, when we went in there together through one of those walkthroughs during SAS sale, Aiden, my middle one, you guys learn Aiden's name. He's the one that loves Bath and Body Works just as much as me. The other ones love it, but Aiden and me, yeah, he steals my stuff. Um, he, he had looked at this one, Pink Watermelon. And he loved the scent and he told me that he wanted it. So I always knew that I was going to eventually get it, you know. But, and as soon as I got it home, he wanted to burn it already. And I said, nope, we can't do that yet. But I'm kind of nervous because um, my husband did at Cold Sniff, he didn't like it. And I love it. I think it's because it smells kind of like candy. Yeah, I think it has like a, a candy scent pink watermelon so it's juicy pink watermelon guys this watermelon pink i thought it was more red but okay sugared strawberry blossoms lime zest with essential oils all that i can smell from this i tell you for from my perspective is just like candy it makes me think like of a laffy taffy i think people are saying jolly ranchers i don't know why i can't remember what the jolly rancher smell smells like because that maybe because we haven't had some in a long time my kids like the laffy taffies and then there's this pink one i can't remember the name that's the one that i think this kind of reminds me of for me so definitely smells like candy we'll see what it smells like i told aiden that once i did this video he can 
uh, turn it on in his room. Right now he has uh, watermelon lemonade. So I don't know. I don't think they're, they're the same, but we will see. He actually has watermelon lemonade, the one wick in his room right now. Now I did hear from reviews that this is very, very strong throw. So I'm thinking if we put it in his room and then we just leave the door open, it might fill up the whole hallways and who knows. Let's see if it goes to the, the living rooms. Next we have all oh, the packaging on this guys. The packaging right here on these, this collection. I love the packaging. So pink apple punch and it has a picture right here of like punch like you know uh yeah so if you guys can see the picture what else yeah and it has apples and then it has the pitcher so that's a pitcher with like a cup like if you're serving a uh, pink apple punch the color to this, this is one of those that I will save. I will save this packaging, hopefully forever. Oh, this is just beautiful. And the smell, the scent, oh my gosh. It's like, it's just heavenly. Oh, pink apple punch, crisp apples. I definitely smell the apples like a little, not too strong of an apple scent, but oh yes sun-kissed melon i don't know if i smell the melon you know it does have that fruity scent to it and sugar crystals with essential oils i'm excited i'm excited to put this one in the living room so i need to either switch out what i have going on over there or we're gonna definitely try these and i think we might turn them on tonight i was just waiting on doing this quick video for you guys so there we go oh i want and i've told you guys that i think i want all of these just for the um for the packaging i smelled the pink lilac while i was there and it was i think that's what it's called is it pink lilacs it's like another pink it's like a lighter pink a different color um and i didn't like the scent because it was too too much rosy like floral scent not rose but floral and i didn't like the scent but when they have a sale i might get it because of the packaging and i'm gonna use it up just so i could use the, um the packaging for it and the last one the one wick and we would this one you guys call it limoncello and i know it's an italian i think um name but for some reason because i speak spanish i just want to say limoncillo and I don't even know if that's exactly how you read it, but that's what I'm limoncillo. But limoncello, this is a strong scent. I just thought of when we're cleaning the house, like turning this on. And I think it's hopefully it puts me in the mood to clean because, you know, I don't know. Some people like to clean. I don't like it. I just have to do it. Um, limoncello, Sorrento lemons, cane sugar, lemon zest. Definitely a strong lemon uh, scent to it with the lemon zest in there uh and i i really liked it me and my sister liked the scent to this one and then i think this would be a good one too for like the restroom make it smell i feel like it'll make it smell like clean so those are the, the only three candles that i got today but i just wanted to talk about how good my experience was especially after making such i don't know if you'd call it like a negative video on my experience with trying to exchange at a different store and it was just horrible but you know what a lot of you guys have always talked in the comments and just in other videos that people do that they have such a good experience you know making exchanges and that's what i wanted to have so yeah that's it for today and i hope that you guys are having a good sunday and i will see you guys back here tomorrow with another video thank you for watching my videos go ahead and if you like the video like comment and subscribe i love talking to you guys in the comments you know i try my best i i believe i get back to all of you if i didn't get back to you on one of those videos i don't know how i got lost let me know i will talk to you i love getting to know you guys and again stay blessed see you in my next video bye